But soon articulation is very simple. You actually already know how to do it. Picture your bassoon reed. Here's the tip of the reed where you put in your mouth. Here's the string and then the bottom part. When you articulate, you want to aim for the bottom blade of the reed. So whatever part of the blade is on the bottom when you are playing is what you want to aim for. When you articulate or tongue, the top of the tip of the tongue touches the tip of your reed. You should use only about two taste buds. When you articulate or tongue, you need to imagine that your tongue is simply interrupting your steady stream of air. Picture a sink with running water. If you were to pass your hand underneath that running water, the water would still be flowing. This is what should happen to your air as well. Your air is like the water, it's continuously flowing. And if you passed your hand under it, it would just get interrupted briefly for a moment. This is what your tongue does to the reed. What you're actually interrupting is the vibration of the reed. Your air is never going to stop. The vibration of the reed will stop just for a brief moment. When you articulate on bassoon, you should think of the syllable two, 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 while you are tonguing. Listen to what a bassoon articulation would sound like on just the bassoon reed. Do you hear how my tongue is just interrupting the sound? Now you try. The secret word is Ninja Turtle.